this is seriously the perfect time to clean my bag because it has so much trash inside and the owner is trash that's why she carries a lot of trash inside her bag but let's do this Hey guys, it's Ina, and I am back with another video. So, if you didn't know it yet, I'm in college already, and I figured that it will be nice to show you what's in my college bag. The degree that I'm taking is Bachelor of Science in Legal Management, and I am on my third year in college, and yeah, there's so much more stress right now, and let's get on to the video. So the bag that I have is just a, this Adidas backpack. It's really heavy. It's just in this military color, military green, olive green color, and it just looks like this. It has these straps that are adjustable size of your bag, like the width of your bag. You can adjust it, you can make it tighter or you can make it looser. And then it has two side pockets there. And the thing is, my friends and I were joking about this, like, I seriously wanted to find up the perfect backpack with two side pockets because I bring a water bottle to school because water is expensive and you don't want to add up to the waste, the garbage that we have. And it has three compartments actually, one in front, one in the middle, and this last pocket is not that obvious it's actually a laptop bag so let's start with the side pockets um i usually carry a water bottle it's my mustard yellow water bottle and i place it in here and uh, let's see if i still have some things on the side which i think i have the left pocket is empty but there are some things in the right pocket and garbage can you ever believe and now we'll proceed to the front pocket of my bag and the first item in here is my phone a dirty handkerchief i should probably put this in the laundry but this cologne this is the christine lillier perfumery it just got it from a random stall at the mall and the scent of vanilla bouquet i i actually got this mainly because it smells like the justin bieber perfume like the first Justin Bieber perfume, the Someday one, I have it, and it seriously smells like it. I like vanilla scented things. The next item in here is a lipstick. This is the Pinkest Collections lipstick in the shade Bark. You know this. This is one of my favorite lipsticks if I am in the mood to wear a lipstick. I have a highlighter in here. I don't know why, but I probably brought it because I wanted to feel extra. The next item in here is my hair tie. I was actually looking for this before I was filming a video because I have my other half of my hair up. I was looking for this and this was inside, so... Okay, a pen. This is not my pen. I actually borrowed it from someone and I think I should return it, but... It's a pen. And then, ooh, I have a lot of trash in here. The thing about this pocket is that it's really deep and I like to call this the magical pocket mainly because when I reach in, there's always candy inside. But now I don't have candy inside, I just have a lot of trash. See? There's so much trash. It's full of bus tickets and candy wrappers. Unfortunately, there's no candy inside, so... Okay, that is it for the front pocket, and now we are going to dwell into the middle pocket. The only thing that I don't like about this is that this flap is pretty stiff and we have checkpoints everywhere in school. It's so hard to open it, but it's nice. It's spacious. It looks like this. And first thing that I see in here is my makeup bag. If you haven't watched my makeup bag video, I'll link it down below or I'll insert a slide up there. So watch it. I have my wallet. My wallet, it's just pink. And then I have my pencil case, which is really, really dirty because I put my sharpener inside and I think the little bits of pencils spilled inside. So all of my pens 
are so dark right now and I need to clean them up like look at this one it's supposed to be white but it has dark particles in it it's so dark now and it kind of makes me not want to use my pens and highlighters anymore because they're so dirty but Oh, I carry a lot of pens and highlighters to school because you can never have many pens. And then I have a book in here. This is my book on the law on negotiable instruments. It's one of my classes. My bullet journal. If you didn't know it yet, I do bullet journaling so you can check out my bullet journal videos somewhere there. <laughs> my bullet journal. I can't live without my bullet journal. The next item inside is my copy of the Philippine Constitution. This is the 1987 Constitution and this is the Kodal one. All you have inside are all the provisions from the Constitution and yeah it's really handy because when you have to memorize your provision you don't have to use the thick textbook you just carry this and it's handy it's really thin and it has all the provisions of the constitution inside which is good. Here I have two big notebooks. I actually only use three notebooks this semester and these are the first two. This is my main notebook for the school year. Well technically I'm just using one notebook. This is my universal notebook. I use this for all of the classes that I have. I just separate them with the headings up here I just put the date and, and the name of the class so this will always be in my bag because this is my notebook for everything you know the thing is when you're in college you bring less school supplies this notebook naman is for my case digests in legal writing because my professor in legal writing do require us to provide a notebook for our case digests and when we're in his class, we're not allowed to bring the actual copy of the cases and we're only allowed to bring our case digests. So if you make wrong case digests, then the thing that you'll be writing for the class will all be wrong. So yeah, it's really tiring to write and write and write and write and read and read and read. But if I want to be a lawyer, then I'll have to deal with that. So, And then the next thing that I have is my photocopy of the bar exams reviewer for negotiable instruments. This one is the thing that we use more because this is what my professor uses and yeah I feel like I wasted money on buying this book but it's nice to have two references and one. So yeah, it's just my photocopy of the negotiable instruments quizzer, bar exam reviewer, and item. No, it's not the last item. I have a rubber band inside. It's just a yellow rubber band. I don't know where it came from, but... Hmm. The last item in here is my file case. I just broke the zipper. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna try to open it. This is my yellow file case and I have copies of cases inside. Cases, handouts, a ruler, some receipts for some official school business, the template for the 10 outstanding junior college students because I was nominated for some reason and I don't know why, but it's just in here. I keep all papers inside and yeah, I always carry this every day. It's so cute. It's yellow and it's cute. So now that the main compartment is empty, we will now go to the laptop bag that is not obvious. Like you wouldn't even think that there's this extra pocket behind it, which I think is really, really smart. And it has lining inside. It has extra cushion inside so that your laptop won't get crushed or something. I don't know how this works, but it works for my laptop. So currently I don't have my laptop in here because I didn't bring it to school last week or anything, but I have a few items inside. A random piece of paper. I used this for memorizing some terms in my economics class. Yep. Was last minute studying. I have a copy of Elle magazine. This is one of the publications that we have in school and if you're from my school you should get a copy because 
the aesthetic of this magazine is insane. Like, and look, the articles, the contents, all the photos that it has inside, you should get one because this magazine is amazing. I have my yellow paper because what is college without yellow paper, right? In some of my classes, when you give paper to your classmates, you have to pay for it, so. And I have legal writing classes, so. Paper is an essential. I also use this for note-taking when I forget my notebook. I have my third notebook. This notebook is for the other case digests that I have in my other major classes because we read a lot of cases. This is really handy especially when I'm reviewing when I have to write or memorize provisions for reference and for note taking for making reviewers. This notebook is for everything. The last two items that I have inside may be TMI but you know, it's an essential. I carry pads inside my bag because don't know when you're gonna get your period don't keep track of my period so it's nice to carry this not only for myself but for all my classmates for or for anyone who needs pads just have to give them one and now that my bag is empty I think that we are through with this video those were the items that I carry in school sometimes I add more items like more books more handouts my laptop I carry it sometimes an umbrella when we're having a bad rainy day and yeah those are the things that I carry inside my bag those are the things that you would usually find inside a third year college student's bag and I hope that you guys like this video if you're as nosy as me give this video a thumbs up because I really like watching what's in my bag videos I am that nosy but yeah if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below so that you'll be notified whenever I make a new video and I hope that you'll have a nice day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!